Okay, we're back again. If you're watching live, that was a quick five minute break, approximately. If you're watching on YouTube, no wait at all. It's amazing. It's like cutting the commercials out of TV on your DVR. <laughs> uh, anyway, this will be episode 19. Still in Funway Park. We've got to finish our uh, amusement park design here. We got to start with, uh, as I quoted it in the description of the video, a bitchin' train setup. I like this bridge over the front, uh, you know, near near the gates and everything, and two uh, two train stations so people can get from kind of either side. I, I don't know if they'll actually use it that way, but maybe they'll get more riders like that. So, still, we're completely redesigning this, so I'm gonna keep the simulation paused. I think I'm going to make this a curved corner, look better, match the rest of the city. Maybe look better. There we go. And then, I need to make sure I can place my, um... Oh, see, I didn't think about that when I was drawing this. I need to place my, um, roller coaster. Oh, it just barely won't fit. Come on. Come on. Come on. Um, okay. So... Maybe we do need to make this sharper cornered here. Mm, can't delete that one. Actually, I can get it a little closer. Yeah, it's a little better. Let's see how much room this takes up, because maybe we can make this work. Ooh. Ooh. Alright. I want that right there. And then... <laughs> oh, 90s movies. And then we'll just do this. And then we'll just do... Oh, come on. You know you want to do it. There. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. And we're going to put another one on this side. Ah. I don't know what I'm clicking. So that used up a lot of space. But that's okay, I guess. Because we're going to have this continue on uh, as far as it can this way. And maybe we'll just actually make this corner here. Come on. There we go. Uh, it's only kind of good. That's better. And then we can come out this way from this one. Oh, maybe not. Good dude, steep roads overlap. Okay. So where can we draw a road over here? We draw it to there. Can't quite come out like that. But we should be able to come on.
What is that? <laughs> there we go. Seriously? There. And then we'll curve this. And we need to do something about this, right? Because I don't want to delete the train station. Seriously. There we go. I should be able to do that. And that. Oh, come on. I guess that's good enough. It's actually a fairly smooth curve, but it, it's not that great. I mean, looks a little weird. Alright, let's see if I can do a little bit better. <laughs> I couldn't, I, I was trying to talk myself into it, and I couldn't do it. There, that's much better. And then I think, because we're going to need to maximize some space uh, usage. Oh. I'm going to see if I can get this to... There we go, straight. I'm going to bring it down here. And then I'm going to bring this across. So then we can have some usable, some hopefully better usable space over here. Now, I want to put the two go kart speedways next to each other. They won't quite fit in here. So, okay, I'm not going to have room for two go kart speedways. Oh, that sucks. Alright, maybe we don't do two roller coasters, because that's, that's too, it's just too big. Takes up too much room. So then on this side, we'll actually do the two. We'll do one over here. Can we put them back to back? Oh, no, that's too close. I do want to put them back to back over here, though. Do I? Or do I maybe want to try to do it over here? Uh, it won't work. Maybe I just do them next to each other over here. It looks dumb next to each other like that, though. I kind of, I mean, I want one at least to be turned around the other way, or, you know, something. <coughs> Alright. We will do it this way. We need one to come across like this, possibly. I don't know if that's straight. I know it's straight from here. Fairly. Too close. That's probably too far, but... Oh, 
Does it need to actually connect or something? Overlapping. I would think that would actually be enough room for it. It looks like it. It totally is. Oh. oh, do we have another stupid, like, popcorn stand or something in here? Where are you? I bet we do somewhere. Because that's, <laughs> that's what happened the last time. Hey, Cody Wynn. Good to see you again. Where are your little popcorn set? So yeah, cannot draw through place buildings. Where's the place building? Right over here somewhere. There it is. Ha! Trees were hiding it. So that was annoying, <laughs> but now that we have it fixed, yeah. See, we can we can move this closer. Like here, maybe. Ooh, we could even move it a little bit closer. Right here. That'll work. There, now that at least looks interesting. And we can do something weird with this part. Uh, right over here. There we go. I don't care about four-way intersections for people walking. Um, oh, we need to place our Ferris wheel, too. I think a big one over here, and we'll put one face it this way. No, uh, I like it facing the water like this. Put it over here, because then, yeah, it's starting to look like a pretty cool amusement park. Can't fit one of those sideways, but I definitely. Let's see, these hold the most. These are cool, but they're the biggest. And they, they hold the second most because they have a larger line capacity. So. Can I place these anywhere in here? No. But these will fit like this. So let's put one here. Hmm. Oh, that actually works really well. Let's put one there. And then we'll put one here. And maybe here. I, I mean, I kind of like it here, but I kind of don't. Nah, it'll work. And then. I mean, we really could put another one of these over here, but I don't want two of them right next to each other. Carousel won't fit, though. Swing ride. Oh, there we go. Perfect. What'll fit up here? That's the... This is the hard part, as I don't think actually much of anything will fit. Oh. 
That's terrible, because I was planning on being able to use that space. Okay, what if we... Hmm... What do we have for room if we move this? Oh, that's right, we couldn't fit it that way. It's just tough. I don't know how I'm going to fit everything in here. Is there something else in on the ground here? Or is it just not letting me place it facing sideways? I don't see anything. Hmm. <laughs> So, maybe I will have to do it this way. I'm gonna take that out. I'm gonna take that out. I'm gonna put this on it in. And it'll be kind of boring, but we'll make better use of our land, so. Meh. <laughs> and we should have another one of these. And then, like, yeah, carousels and stuff will fit over here. I can probably, yeah, I could even fit one of these. But what fits over here? One of these? Not that. Okay, this fits. I'll put one there. We can probably put another pirate ship in over here. Actually, let's put it in over here at the corner. So I'm not going to be able to max these out because I don't think I'm. I can't fit anything over here either, unless I maybe just take that road out. Yeah, so I could fit one of these. There you go. Hmm. 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 Oh, so close. One well, of those will fit, but I think I would rather put one of these in. And then I can actually just space this out a little bit. Why do I have three entrances? Um, it says Nitty568. For the amusement park, it's because uh, you can get three entrances, and it adds capacity, and I forget what it says on them. Add a second amusement, uh, a second gate to your amusement park to give your visitors another entrance to your massive, sprawling amusement park. It's redundant, but, you know, it explains it. Basically, it's just more entrances, and there's a ton of people that walk along this road, and I thought it looked cool. Right? Boom. Looks pretty cool. Um, but that's about all we can fit as far as rides go, which sucks, because I still have two more rides. Oh, wait. Now I can put something over here. Fit that. Hmm. Definitely fit a couple of these. And these hold more people, so I always prefer, I always tend to lean towards them. And I think that's about it. I don't think I can fit anything else in. Okay, so we're one shy on the little rides. Which I actually, I could take out one of these dizzy drop towers too. There's only two of them. And there's a ton of the other stuff. There's only one carousel too though. Which, can I fit a carousel over here? Because I'd rather put a carousel. No, I can't. Okay. <laughs> Figures.
Thank you. I'm glad you like it, Nitty. Um, so anyway, I think that's done for the redesign on the amusement park. I think it came out looking pretty good. Uh, oh. Almost forgot. Place all our concessions. Jeez. Oh, and I think uh, we can move this Funshine sign. Fun. <laughs> Funshine park sign. <laughs> As soon as it'll let me. There we go. Uh, I want to put it across the street right there. Yeah. Or actually, could we face it the other way? This thing takes forever to delete. Oh yeah, it's not. It's not letting me face it the way I want to. And those are about the only places I can put it. So, either side's about the same. Put it on that side, whatever. Okay, let's continue the city. Because this should still be able to make the same profit. Oh, damn it, and I forgot. I was going to do these concession stands and stuff. So, let's actually, I want to first, I want to place these. Is there four way benches or fountains? You can use the facilities. Okay. Uh, let's put this, let's put fountains at the intersections. And the, at the three or more way intersections. Gives him somewhere to sit down. I think it helps um, more Sims stay in the park for a little longer, too. Uh, and then we'll use four way benches at the two-way intersections and the entrances to these things. In fact, on this one, we'll just do one on each side here. Hi, Eric. Hi, a lot of time. <laughs> I'll put one here. And... That's actually a four-way we should be doing this one, or a three-way, whatever. Put one there, and I'll put one here. All right, now we start filling up with this. Let's put a balloon cart, balloon cart, right there. Snack cart halfway, people be getting hungry. And toy stand down at the end so the kids can scream for toys. <laughs> I'm basically just kind of placing these at random. I'm trying to space them out nicely though. Because they all do about the same thing, and they all cost relatively the same, so whatever. They're just different stuff. But I try to rotate through them and give some variety to the sims. Pretend that it matters. Oh, we're almost out of them, actually. Should have spaced them a little farther apart, huh? In fact, we'll take out... Like this one... And this one, and replace it with just a single one. I'm saying take this one out, because it doesn't actually need to be in there. 
and then we'll put some over here. Popcorn stand. There we go. Now, if only I could fit another thing in here, I'd be happy. <laughs> Actually, I wonder... Alright, we're gonna try this here. these over actually we put one of these almost at the end yeah and I can put two there and then I can put one of something on the other side that's too big and of course I can fit one of those and none of this okay so there we go perfect now I have everything put down oh but I need to move a couple of these Put a couple more of these down. Put one down here. And put one over here. We have two more benches we can place. So we might as well place them. Perfect. That is most excellent. Now we will go to full speed. Full speed ahead, Captain Sulu. <laughs> he was captain at some point, get off me. <laughs> Probably next generation they mentioned it like once. <laughs> I'm just saying. <laughs> um, I did want to see... Ooh, I can fit another boat down here. Let's do that. Put a boat here. Remember when I was supposed to get that boat? And then we'll see what we can do to connect the roads here. Yeah, of course I can't. There we go. It's a little weird, but sure. <laughs> we'll put a bus station down there. A bus, uh, no. But a bus stop. A bus stop will work. Park and ride. That's the word I was looking for. But no, that'll work though. Because we did have a uh, high high wait time on our boats. It looks like the amusement park is functioning well. Oh, excuse me, I'm stretching. <laughs> We're definitely making a good amount of money on this one. It's only 9 a.m. Oh, no, it's 9 p.m. I don't think we've got a full day on this one yet with the, the, new, the new setup, so. Oh, yeah, the train. I want to see the train. Hey, look, a little train. And it, it does look, it looks like it does carry people across the, across the thing. Here, slow this down here. Come here, train. Follow. Ah, follow. There we go. <laughs> choo choo! Oh, yep, see, and it drops people off. So, I'm, I'm assuming that they go both ways, which is cool. Wonder if it'll give me rider detail. <laughs> Riders in line. Yeah, no, it doesn't say. That would be funny if it showed up as a transit. You, you know, like something you could check in transit. So we got a lot of buses going on. Speaking of transit, I should check these. 
street cars are still great. Trains are good. Boats should be coming down in time a little bit with this third uh, ferry terminal. One thing I don't didn't do up here is streetcar tracks. I sh I could figure out like I might be able to sneak some streetcar tracks back behind here. And I can figure something out. Hmm. Possibly. I'll think about it. And a lot of boats going by. I like to see the residential boats coming in too. Oh. We almost made money with our last payout, or with our last event, so we're totally doing that one again. The World Championship, because that brings in medium and high wealth uh, tourists, and we're right across from the friggin' airport, so I don't know why I didn't think about that last time. 100 tourists waiting to depart. At 123,000 a day. 19,000. Why did you all of a sudden go down? I mean, you have like. This guy's like doing pretty good. I wonder why he's. Oh, well. It must have been shut down yesterday because, I mean, it's only 6 a.m. and we're already today. We've made just as much money as yesterday, so. Weird. Yeah, this one's making 148,000. Good. Hello, Boo Boo. I'm doing great. How are you doing? Let's see here. These houses need to grow in a little bit better. Where's the shopping? Sh Where's the, the shopping? Is seriously? It's right here. The shopping is right here. Just get on your 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 little streetcar and come over here. Because you can totally ride it all the way around and get off here and go shopping. In fact, I'll even I'm gonna put the streetcar track across the road here. and put one of these on. There. It's easy to get shopping. So if my... Oh! <laughs> Well, I'm glad you can join. So, uh, Boo Boo says he sleeps when, when I normally stream, so he watches my episodes. Uh, uh, I don't know if you watch them on Twitch or, or on uh, um, YouTube, but either way is cool. And, um, but he watches them while, while I sleep, so. Um, and I forgot what I was going to say before. Anyway. <laughs> oh, yeah, if, if I go silent or something, I have a mute button. Um, so if I have to cough or something, I can I can mute real quick and cough. But if for some reason it gets stuck and you don't hear me talking for like 10 minutes, let me know because I'm just going to be talking to myself. And I guess that's okay if I do that, but I probably shouldn't. So <laughs> at least at least when there's a chat room, I, I feel like I'm talking to people. <laughs> Even if there's nobody there, I can pretend I can pretend I'm talking to to a billion people or anything to make me not sound crazy. <laughs> so I know there's a lot of these pirate ship things, but they're small. They, they fit way better. <laughs> and they hold a lot of people, so it's kind of a win-win there. Because, yeah, we're at 108,000 today, and it's 7 p.m., 125,000. <laughs> yeah. 
making quite a bit of money in the amusement park arena. Speaking of arena, hey, we have our first positive payout, and it's just starting, so that'll even increase a little bit more. Rock on. Well, not rock, because this, is, this isn't the rock concert. This is the World Championship of Football. So. <laughs> Alright, no, now we know we can attract enough uh, people to the city and get them to the pro stadium, which is super excellente. You know, it's funny, this, abandoned, this building abandoned earlier, and um, it was a different color the first time, too, so I wonder if they come in different shades. But when I demolished it, it was uh, it was the same building before, and it came came to the same building here. So why is this one... Okay, because it's not getting enough shoppers. Why are you not getting enough shoppers? Maybe I do need to put Maglev in, because that'll move high wealth tourists around the city a little bit better. Hmm. It's a thought. Not sure. Thinking about it. Anyway, how close are we on here? Oh, very close. Maybe, maybe in the next twenty-four hours of game time, we'll uh, we'll go over our four hundred thousand mark. Now these need to be fixed, so they'll fit in place. Didn't go to school? See, I don't understand how these people are, like, not going to school. They're teaching everybody, like, everybody... Students enrolled, 829 out of 829. So. Something, something is not reporting right to let me know how to fix this. <laughs> oh. Couldn't find work. Couldn't find work. I have no unemployed people. I don't have that many available jobs, but so some something's not reporting right to let me know how to fix this. And this intersection is still working okay. There's a lot more people coming through it now. So it's, I mean, it's mostly this backup going out of the city here. Which is really clogged up because this is, this is a, a meeting. I don't think this would change, though. Even if I made it low density, I don't think it would stop them. I think they would just continue, yeah, see, they just continue straight on. So, I, I think it looks better, high density. How's the dinosaur doing? Woo! A lot of people. <laughs> I should check because I haven't checked to make sure. I'm, I'm sure I'm muted here for a while. Let's see what the sound says. Oh no, I'm not muted. All right, excellent. So far, so good on the cough button. Well, what's annoying is it's not. It's not actually a cough button. You have to. It's an on-off. So I have to turn it off. Cough. Turn it on. It's. <laughs> And hope that I that I that it actually registered because there's no on-screen display or anything to help let me know. Growing in there. There we go.
Hopefully these will grow in correctly. This one I'm sure I'm going to have to fix. But I want this side. This side's going to definitely make one, so I'm going to wait until this side does. And then I'm not sure what to do back here. Because I don't really need that many residents. I need some high wealth, but it's not that bad. Because I got some over here. No shoppers. How do you not have shoppers? There's people walking by your door every day. And these people next door say business is great. And these people say these tourists are great for sales. But the guy in the middle is not getting anything. So, okay. Oh, we didn't schedule, I forgot to schedule an event. Well, we made 50 grand on our last event. And I think it's after 8 p.m., so I don't think it'll, yeah, I, I can actually schedule it right now. And it won't start until tomorrow. Yeah. Event scheduled for tomorrow. Cool. How is our happiness factor looking? Not enough shoppers, not enough shoppers. Needs workers. Okay. <laughs> Need education. Kids couldn't go to school. How are they not getting to school? I mean, seriously. There's plenty of room in here. The school buses are, I mean, there's school bus stops are placed all around nicely. School buses on here. They're all turned on, I believe. I didn't turn any of them off. Yeah, they're all turned on. Oh, I didn't place the flag, but, I mean, there's something I'm missing here, and I don't understand what it is. It's not, and we have plenty of education. Oh, there's a couple over here. I don't know if their kids will take school buses. <laughs> do high wealth so so high wealth residents don't take buses, but do their student do high wealth students take school buses? It's a good question. I hope they do. I imagine they do. But I mean, at Sim City, some of the decisions don't always make sense. Oh. I just got some email notifications. Thank you for all my followers, all the followers that, on Twitch. Uh, Eric1237, Oxay Moron, and Space Muff Spacey Muffin, Spacey Muffins. Sounds good. I wonder if that. I wonder if you put those, you know, little uh, candy stars that you can use for like ice cream topping. So that's what Spacey Muffins would have, like baked into them. That'd be good. That's right. I'll stop now because I'm just making myself hungry. <laughs> All right. Sorry, they just cleaning out some inventory. Uh, tell me, did I make an elementary? No, it's just a high school. Um, it holds more people, and there's no um, there's no education uh, uh, difference. My other cities run with just universities, and they run great. Everybody goes, gets a, not even everybody is making it to the education in those cities, but nobody complains. In this city, every single student is enrolled, and I have people abandoning because of uh, no education. Like, it, it doesn't, I, I don't, I don't understand it. Teaching all the students, buses are going, you know, collecting students. See, I don't understand why these not enrolled keep coming back in. If you get on the bus, the school bus, why are you not, you know, going to school? Because the school is nowhere near full.
So I just, I, I guess I don't understand where these students are coming from. Or where these unenrolled students are supposedly coming from when it tells me here that they're all enrolled. It's just, it's mismatch of information and it's super annoying. The same thing happens sometimes with garbage. It hasn't happened in this city, but you'll see that it's like, oh, by the numbers, I'm not collecting any garbage. And then you go, you look at your garbage map and it's like this. You have nothing, you know. <laughs> One or two little spots where they're just, doop, just tidying up. And it's just barely past noon. Oh, it's barely past one, so... <laughs> Oh, um, Nitty, my name on Origin is the same as this one, but I'm actually doing this region solo. So, um, sorry, not not this region, but in other regions, I, I definitely welcome other people to play. It's just this particular region I'm building up by myself, so. Nothing against you. And you're welcome to add me on Origin. I'm, uh, this, like I said, the screen name is the same as here on, on Twitch. It's Tinvec with two N's. My own made-up phonetic alphabet, Tango, Indo, Indigo, Nancy, Nancy, Victor, Edward, Charlie. <laughs> I don't know. Just coming up with it here. Oh, did I place the... No, I, yeah, I put that in the right place. I don't know if we're going to make money on our event this time. I'm, I'm, I'm not sure why people don't make it up there, because we have plenty of people in the city, obviously. Our uh, amusement park is making, hell, we made almost $200,000 yesterday. Our casinos are raking in the cash. This one's not making quite so much, this sci-fi casino. I wonder if it's because it's got no high wealth stuff. And there's more high wealth tourists in the city. Hmm? Oh no, there's not that many high wealth. Maybe we need more medium wealth stuff. I'm really not sure with that one. Okay, good. Now we are actually making money on our. our Soccer event. Let's look here. Students commuting in. Yeah, Tommy, I've d I was doing the rock concert and I was losing a ton of money. When I started doing the soccer, I started making more money because the soccer pulls in medium and high wealth people, whereas the pro or the the rock concert, while it's a it's a bigger you know, it's a possible bigger payout, it only does low and medium wealth. And I had a lot of higher wealth people, I'm right across from the, the airport, so at least that's my thinking. Um, next time around, uh, you know, as soon as we pass midnight here and the, the, the event ends, I'll, I'll do a rock concert and see if maybe this, maybe now I've fixed the, the traffic or something, and we'll, we'll be making enough money. Or making, yeah, we'll make enough, uh, get enough people in there. So, it's not showing any workers commuting so they must all be coming from the great work. And no shoppers commuting. So all the shoppers that are commuting in must be from the great work. We're getting freight. And we do have a lot of students coming in. It says 558. Okay, so we have a lot of students coming in from over here. Which is stupid because they have a university that they're not using over there. <laughs> uh, okay. Still, I think we built a pretty badass amusement park up front here. With the train that goes around. Yeah. I, I don't I wanna see the train go this way though, and it, it only seems to go around the track this way. Like I wanna see it go over the stop highlighting it. I wanna see it go over the top of the uh you know, I made a, a bridge there and it's, it looks pretty frickin' sweet. And I don't I want it to go that way. The academy, the academy is in the another city. It's um, it's, I've already researched basically everything I need to research for for that. 
So this is this is an amusement park specific city. All right, we're gonna try this. Yeah, see, they can totally go over that way. Why don't they? If they have, well, do they always take the shortest route? They're just as stupid as other Sims. But see, that's way cooler. They they should have they should be going both ways. No, now they'll all just go this way. That's so stupid. A little bit of a traffic jam at these T intersections. I, I always, uh, I think I said this in the last video or something, I, I always expect that. Um, because the, these two are pretty close, and... I, I figure it actually simulates a, a real city uh, where if you've ever been to a really big amusement park, it, it's impossible. Like, you get within, you know, half a mile of that place and it's just gridlocked 24-7 because of everybody trying to get in and out of that place. So, I, I thought it added a touch of realism to it. I really wish they would go, like, around the city all the way. And I am actually willing to destroy uh, one of these train stations to make them do it. Because <laughs> I don't think you have to have them in pairs, but... Because I wanted them to go along the coast and across the entrance. That's freaking cool. Like, did I not build a cool thing? <sighs> it's a pain in the ass. One-way one -way train tracks. Come on. <laughs> oh, yeah, schedule. Uh, whoops, oh, this one. So we got some good commercial there. Oh, this should grow up into one. Cool, that one, that one did, some, did it itself. So everyone's super happy now. Oh, what's up with that water? Why is it yellow? I don't get why it's yellow. Like, everything has water in the city. Pump's not going dry or anything. Could add another one on, we're making enough money. Actually provide water for ourselves. But it's not a it's really not a big deal at all. Mega towers. Mega towers. Everybody loved a mega towers. I don't need people. And I don't have a lot of unsatisfied tourists. I did, however, want to do a uh, an amusement park. The the you know the roller coaster on top, like that's what I thought would be cool. And the one place that is, there's actually a perfect amount of room already in my city, I don't have to bulldoze anything, is right here. It's one spot. <laughs> Every, everywhere else is wouldn't fit or I'd have to bulldoze or nowhere else in the city that I, that it would go because this is too close nowhere up here, no, what, right here so it would work I would get a lot of tourists and stuff I would take out some of my residential but that would be okay um mm-hmm mm-hmm mm -hmm. I don't know. Alright, I'm gonna place it for now. Because I gotta figure out the roads too. Zoom in. And I don't want that topic. Couldn't find work. Couldn't find shops or parks. So this tower would basically be pretty close to self sustaining. Because, I mean, we have most everything in the city and 
if I'm doing a low wealth, lower, lower wealth tower, it's going to be, um, you know, there's, I'm not going to be able to have high wealth people in it. I have medium, but not, not high wealth. We have a lot of low wealth commuting in, so I'm gonna try to maybe change that a little bit. But we're gonna pause for like five minutes. Not even. We're gonna pause for like a minute and a half while I just run and grab an another cup of coffee. And you guys can enjoy the coastline of the city. Okay, back with coffee. I hope you enjoyed the view. I think it actually looks pretty good. Um, yeah. So even though the trains aren't going both ways, they at least go along the coast here, which looks which gives us a really nice little view. But let's check our event. Lost a little money. Let's try to schedule that event again. Our happiness is coming up a lot, though. 81%. I'm, I'm cool with that for now. Um, I'm going to decide what to do over here. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, you like that? The boats, the boats all... There's so many boats that go through each other. Because there's two here, and then there's one here. Yeah, I'm losing some money because of the event. Um, I, I just paid for the other event, too, so it looks really bad. <laughs> that was paid another 300 grand um, and we and we did lose money on our last event so hopefully we'll make money on this event we, we did make money on the one with the the soccer one but we'll see how that goes our amusement park uh, made 200 over 200 grand yesterday I'd like to make a quarter of a million dollars in this amusement park that would be pretty friggin cool the casinos still making good money. This one back here makes good money. And all right, so yeah, yeah. I guess this sci-fi one just doesn't make nearly as much money. Let's see what we have. What's going on for tourism here? Okay, we have plenty of capability of people. We have a lot of high wealth still trying to come in. So let's build that medium and high wealth casino. Roman Luck. Sounds kind of cool. How big is the elegant one? Eh, a little bigger. We could still fit it over here. Yeah, let's put the elegant casino in. I don't know. Maybe it'll make money. Maybe it won't. Do I... Uh, Killstreak asks, do I stream this every day? Um, pretty close. Um, I do about an hour on weekdays, because I, I have a day job and everything. And then on weekends, I stream as I can, but I'll usually do, uh, you know, three, four hours each day. It just depends on what I have going on for the weekend. What we can do for add-ons here. I don't I don't build a lot of casino places so or casino towns so I'm not really familiar with um, um so, okay so these are towers just like the other ones what's this exclusive club attracts high wealth tourists and adds high wealth gambling capacity okay 
So this is just an outside thing. Although it would actually work pretty good right over here. Right along the water? Oh yeah. And then... Put that here. And these are medium wealth, right? Oh, okay. So we could probably fit two of these. Oh yeah, like that. Alright, and so these are only high, only the top ones are high wealth, so... I guess we do this. That's kind of small. Got a lot of room, so why don't we? Why, yeah, let's put it right out here. That looks pretty good. And that's like totally casino, casino row. <laughs> cool. What do we need for our next one? Oh, four hundred thousand. Yeah, we still need four hundred thousand for that. Totally full on tourists, maxed out. Probably, probably won't be able to make quite a quarter of a million a day on that, but it'll be good. A rock concert still not doing so hot, but our people are happier. I'm not sure why they're not growing high density here. Or here. Oh, because they're, yeah, they're not quite happy now. Same with these guys, I guess. Oh, speaking of. <laughs> but I know that they're not going to fit anyway, so why don't I bulldoze this? Minus $10,000? Yeah. I realize I lose money on this. That's okay. At the moment, it's no big deal. I can go steal some money from the other cities if I need to. I have plenty of money right now. Um, even though this isn't a a um, sandbox region, still, I have just tons of cash. <laughs> yeah, Boo Boo says that with 10 back, negative 10k is nothing. Um, in this city, it matters because uh, there's no... Um, there's no exports, um, <clears throat> so I, I do have to get positive in this city, but uh, I shouldn't have a problem once all the casinos get going, because I think this one's still, yeah, this one's losing 90000 a day right now, because it's not, I gotta attract that, you know, I gotta wait for everything to kind of spin up in the, in the town. Plus with this city, there's an expensive casino, 10000 an hour. So, <laughs> I gotta wait, once everybody starts filling up. Yeah, so now we have 387 tourists. Waiting for lodgers, mostly. Yeah, see, now we're making 21,000 an hour on it. And we're positive 13,000 down here. So we're doing all right. We're still doing okay on this intersection. Like I say, it's not amazing, but I think it's fairly good given the tools that I have available. Plus, it was a little fun to build. Still have some room here to do something with here and here. What do I need? I could put people here, but I don't want to because they're right next to the pro stadium. Uh, tell me, why can't you get the game? Is it not available in your area, or do you just not have enough money to, to buy it? Because I think there's some fairly cheap, um, I mean, you, you won't have, you, you, like, 
this amusement park is a DLC, um, but most of the rest of this is just comes with the game. Um, and I think that they're... Oh God, what is the cheapest ones I saw were like... I know they recently had a sale for like 15 bucks, but I think it's out, but... 420 hours in this game. <laughs> I, I'm not sure what... Uh, between the next streams, I'll check how many hours I have in this game, because I haven't checked for a while, but I know it's over 800. Alright, we got four here, four here. As soon as these guys decide to grow up, there should be four there. And then I gotta, I, I'm gonna increase wealth over here, and I gotta decide what to do with this. Because I've been thinking about doing, um, because I, I'm actually over on my stream here. But we're gonna talk about what we're gonna do on the next stream. Um, thinking about doing a, um, oh, thank you, Boo Boo, for following my YouTube channel. Like a park and service tower here. Um,. What do I have available? Because I don't, I don't, yeah, I haven't researched a lot of the other services. But I could make this, like, I don't, I won't need a wage reduction level if I don't have a lot of people. And I don't care about Skybridge Station, if it's going to be the only tower in the city. We don't need, a, we don't need power. And we don't have drones in the city, so whatever, we're just going to make this, like, a park. We can, okay, we can move the education into here, and make this a park and education tower. With some, you know, like, two apartment levels, a mall, and an office or something. For medium wealth. Maybe. And then we can put the Skyclops crown on top. Alright. That's going to be the next episode. We'll call this, uh, call this the end. We're like five minutes over. Whatever. I don't, you, you know, I don't care about being exactly on time. So... <laughs> Uh, as usual, if you want to catch what I do live, follow me on Twitch. Uh, this uh, know when I start streaming. Um, I usually say something funny at the very beginning of the stream, so only YouTube people get it, I guess, because <laughs> that's or, or if you watch after the fact on Twitch. But anyway, I, I always export. Speaking of YouTube, I always export my stuff to YouTube, so you can uh, always watch there. You can subscribe to my channel. Uh, maybe watch the whole series all at once when I'm all done, and just to see how far we've come. Um, Anyway, I will see you all in about five minutes. I'm just going to take a quick break, restart SimCity, make sure everything's flowing good on the stream. and. We'll